to recognize the gentleman from Whitley for explanation of the bill and a motion thereof. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, last year this honorable body enact, uh, passed House Bill 499, the Employee Child Care Assistance Partnership Program. What this bill did was appropriate funding to provide a state employer match towards child care costs for those working families who are just above the poverty line. Through this program, an employer will offer assistance to their employee for child care, then the state will match it on a dollar for dollar basis. For example, if an employer offers $250 uh, to cover an em employee's child care cost, then the state will match that $250, then there's $500 going towards the daycare bill. That $500 may be what helps some families decide to stay in the workforce. Child care costs are very expensive, and this can help some families. House Bill 165 implements two small changes to the Employee Child Care Assistance Partnership Program. First, the Cabinet for Health and Family Services, they're required to report specifics on this program. They report it to us, the General Assembly. Uh, House Bill 165 expedites that report date to December 15th of 2023 so that we have that data available to us at an earlier date and ready for the 2024 legislative session. Second, this program is technically a contract between the employer, employee, the child care provider, and the Commonwealth of Kentucky. House Bill 165 amends the statute to permit a child care provider to terminate an act of contract created pursuant to the program. Uh, Mr. Speaker, if there are no questions, I move passage of House Bill 165. 